Convective available potential energy may be related to the potential for severity in a thunderstorm. Kinetic energy per unit mass of the updraft air is equal to a half W squared, where W is the updraft strength in meters per second. And that can be equated directly to the cape, so that a half W squared is equal to the cape. Cape is the maximum possible energy available in a thunderstorm updraft, excluding supercells, where there are other dynamics going on. So larger cape can imply stronger updrafts, and stronger updrafts can support larger raindrops and larger hailstones. The liquid water and the hailstones can spend longer inside the storm, growing in size. Cape can also produce strong surface winds. Here's an example trace where the cape is only 340 joules per kilogram, which is actually quite small. And you can see that by the small area between the saturated adiabat at which parcels are ascending inside the storm and the temperature profile. For 340 joules per kilogram, you solve the equation as shown. W is equal to the square root of twice the cape, and that gives you an updraft of 26 meters per second. Know that this is a theoretical maximum, and often the values are typically no more than about half of this for various reasons we'll explore in other videos.